Now, there's an interview, a radio interview that's playing out today on Sirius XM. It was a sit down with the Washington Examiner. Mm -hmm. And this is what the president had to say about one of his heroes, whose portrait is now up in the Oval Office, Andrew Jackson. I said, when was Andrew Jackson? It was 1828. That's a long time ago. They love Andrew Jackson in tennis. Yeah, he's, he's a fascinating I mean, had Andrew Jackson been a little bit later, you wouldn't have had the Civil War. He was, he was a very tough person, but he had a big heart, and he was, he was really angry that he saw what was happening with regard to the Civil War. He said, there's no reason for this. I think he's rewriting history. I think. Uh, I'm going to consult John Meacham, who knows everything about Andrew Jackson, go back to the books, but... I don't think that, that was... If he said there's no reason for this, it was probably because of the resistance by the North, <laughs> not so much <laughs> what the South was doing. No, I, again, um, there's a clear lack of understanding of the history of this country, uh, particularly with matters related to race and civil, civil rights and uh, the Civil War. Uh, and I think that this aggrandizement of, of J uh, Jackson is, you know, okay, fine, I get it. Again, the strength is the guy who was cutting his own path, is the doing his own campaigner. thing. The populist campaigner, he said campaigner, elsewhere his campaign was like mine. But the policies behind the man and the man himself say something very different. Hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.